Good morning, friends. It is Monday morning, January the 11th, 2021, and this is Cafe Devo, almost live from First Congregational Church in beautiful downtown Duran, Michigan. I'm Pastor Steve Wood. I got one of my favorite cups filled this morning with an Irish cream flavored coffee, and I hope your day is off to a good start. Thank you for joining me. Let's read this morning from the book of 1 John, chapter 3, verse 2. Dear friends, now we are children of God. And what we will be has not yet been made known. But we know that when he appears, we shall be like him, for we shall see him as he is. I'm going to be reading this morning from a book by C.S. Lewis. It's actually called A Year with C.S. Lewis. It's published 2003, edited by Patricia Klein, HarperCollins Publishers. Blurry Visions of God. When you come to knowing God, the initiative lies on his side. If he does not show himself, nothing you can do will enable you to find him. And in fact, he shows much more of himself to some people than to others. Not because he has favorites, but because it is impossible for him to show himself to a person whose whole mind and character are in the wrong condition. Just as sunlight though it has no favorites, cannot be reflected in a dusty mirror as clearly as in a clean one. You can put this another way by saying that while in other sciences the instruments you use are things external to yourself, like microscopes and telescopes, the instrument through which you see God is your whole self. And if a person's self is not kept clean and bright, their glimpse of God will be blurred, like the moon seen through a dirty telescope. That is why false religions exist. They have been looking at God through a dirty lens. Bless us with clarity this day, O Lord. Guide our steps, watch over us, and have your hand on us. May we see you today as you are, and may we see you in others. We make this prayer in the name of Jesus. Amen. Well, thank you for taking a minute or two with me this morning, my friends. I hope you have a fantastic day. I hope that you will be a blessing. I'll see you tomorrow. Mm